This is how you can win all of Skeppy's events. In this video, I'm going to show you a few tips that you can use to improve your odds drastically while participating in Skeppy's events. Before I go on any further, please leave a like, subscribe, and turn on that notification bell so that I know you guys are enjoying the videos. According to my last video, only 33% of you guys are subscribed to the channel. It would mean a lot if you would subscribe, and it takes less than a second to do. Now back with the video. You might be wondering, if this is how to win every event, why am I not winning every event? It turns out that no matter what, there are some things that you can't control in his events. In this video, I will be covering a range of topics that will help you and your chances of winning in Skeppy's events. I will be talking about things that you can practice before his events, types of skins that you should use, and what you can do to improve your chances of winning whenever luck is involved. So, to start off the video, I will be talking about things that you can practice to perform better in Skeppy's skill-based events. From researching most of Skeppy's events, I have learned that there is almost never any PvP. This means that you can be worry-free of PvP if you happen to be bad at it. What there is quite a bit of is parkour. If you are currently not good at parkour, I recommend that you practice on a parkour server. There are plenty of parkour servers out there, so find one and spend a few hours practicing on there. Hopefully you can get good at a range of jumps so you can handle whatever Skeppy throws at you. In events such as shifting events, or punching events, and such, you should practice some sort of endurance training. You can practice by doing it in your free time, or maybe just holding down your mouse while you are playing a game. Anything helps. A good server to practice on is MunchyMC, as there are a lot of Skeppy-esque events in it, and you will be able to practice. Bad Boy Halo does events like these on his stream every Saturday, so that is another good way to practice your skills. Now, I will go on about what types of skins you should use. The types of skins may sound useless, but trust me, it comes into play in most of his events. Whenever Skeppy is executing people, he is most likely to not kill you if you have a skin that he likes. Also, if you pick a skin that Skeppy likes, he will root for you and oftentimes make it easier for you subconsciously. Seriously, changing your skin is very easy and can give you a good advantage. So, the actual types of skins that you should use consist of derpy skins that relate to the event that you are currently in. A good example is when during a Don't Stop Running event, someone had a track skin. Although they didn't win, Skeppy rooted for them to win. If you want to go the extra step, you can change your name to have it to do with the event as well. Skeppy likes this even more, he will root for you and make it easier if you have a skin and a name that has to do with his event. But seriously guys, I really encourage you to come up with a creative skin. It'll look better for Skeppy's videos, and it will improve your odds on winning. Now, for how you can improve your luck in his events. You might be thinking, gold, it is impossible to improve your luck. That may be true, but it turns out Skeppy's luck-based events are still events that you can gain an advantage in. From watching his events, I have learned that you should always pick the last thing they picked, whether it be color, side, so on. This will improve your luck, as they are less likely to kill the same side or color twice in a row. Now, if you've made it through the video so far, I congratulate you. If you use all of these tricks that I have told you about just now, it will make your chances go from 1 in 100 to much more likely odds. Although I don't have any proof of my own to show, if you look at all the people that have won his events, you will see that they all use these tips that I've shown in this video. Remember, if you do want to participate in these events for a chance to win, you're going to have to pay a lot of money, so it's only worth it if you know how to win and improve your odds so that you can win money from it. Now, if you haven't already, be sure to check out my last video with Dream. I saw that it didn't get as many views as my usual videos, so I'd recommend you check it out. 
I really enjoyed making the video and it took me a while to edit. If you have any questions on how you can do better, be sure to leave it in the comment section below. Remember to like the video and subscribe to the channel. I hope to see you guys in some of my next videos. Also, again, I'd just like you guys to remember, this won't increase your chances to 100% of winning as there's multiple people using this strategy. So I'd just say, don't go into Skeppy's events knowing that you're gonna win because most likely you're not. There's a bunch of other people who are training as well as you are. So just remember that. Okay, but now for real. See you guys.